I know he's killing me. The 20,000 people in the arena know he's killing me. My teammates know he's killing me. We all know he's killing me. <laughs> <laughs> Curry steps in, takes a teardrop, and he's got it. Little pump fake, little fly by, and another Curry three. So when we talk about great shooters of today, we talk about shooting off the dribble and, you know, coming off screens, getting a shot, moving without the basketball, running around, catch, shoot. The greatest shooter, you know, by far, I think he's already been stamped, got the tag, Steph Curry. Okay, so I'm going to go back to, to my arrow. Now I'm going to talk to you about Mark Price. Price revving it up for three. <laughs> Price around four. Backs it. Price for the lead. Got it for the three. Mark Price off the pick and roll. One of the greatest shooters I've ever seen in all game. Now, there's a thing we call 50, 40, 90. Guy shoots 50% from the field. 40% from the three, 90 from the line. That was Mark Price back then. Mark Price can come off screens, he can catch it, he can shoot it, but then he was fast and he was quick and he could run all day. And then there's this thing now where they split the screen, but Mark Price was coming off and he was splitting the screen and then he's pulling up, popping, pop, excuse me, from the three point line. <laughs> His shot making, his foul shooting, and then his speed made him like almost unguardable during that era. Price over Isaiah from deep. He got another triple to go. We were at the Palace and we were playing against Cleveland and Mark Price, he was killing me the first quarter. Chuck Daly calls timeout. I come to the bench. Chuck goes, Isaiah, Mark's killing you. He's killing you. And I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna get it together. And so we go back out, Mark Price, Hits another three. Quick call, timeout. We come to the bench. Chuck goes, Mark is killing you, Isaiah. Like, you, you got to do something. I say, hey, Chuck, Chuck, listen to me. I know he's killing me. The 20,000 people in the arena know he's killing me. My teammates know he's killing me. Can you tell me something that's going to help me right now to stop this dude from killing me? Because we all know he's killing me. <laughs> This is a big leap just in terms of watching Steph today shoot the basketball and comparing him to Price because you can't really make that as a, an accurate comparison because Steph Curry has done something so uniquely different in our league. What Mark Price was doing so difficult and rare back then, and those things in our league, they were just starting to appear. So when we see that happening today, you know, you always have to give the originators, the ones who started it, the pioneers, you always have to go back and remind people of what really sparked the imagination of players and of coaches to incorporate these things. Basketball, in a lot of ways, is a lot like music. They say there's no such thing as new music. There's new ways of using it. But as Earth, Wind, and Fire said, sounds never dissipate. It only recreates in another place. And basketball is the same way.